I know what you guys are thinking. I'm about a year late for this unboxing, but whatever. I didn't want to pay full price for this, and now I got it slightly cheaper. So here we have Sonic Boom Fire and Ice, the launch edition for Nintendo 3DS. This game was the game that nobody expected to happen. I mean, nobody saw this coming at all. After the reception of Rise of Lyric and Shattered Crystal, nobody were expecting them to make another game, but here they are with another one anyways. Master the elements, get fired up. Harness the power of fire and ice as you race to stop Dr. Eggman and brand new enemy defect. Battle huge bosses, multiplayer bot racing, street, street pass, local play. I'm kind of saddened by the fact they don't have download play, but oh, that's okay. Now, this being the launch edition, you get the you get a DVD which contains three episodes of the TV show Sonic Boom. And these episodes include Metal Sonic and Shadow, which is probably the only way Canadians can actually view it because, well, unfortunately the show isn't airing on a channel I currently have on television. So here we have Chili, Dog Day Afternoon, uh, it wasn't me, it was the one-armed hedgehog. It takes a village to defeat a hedgehog. And yeah, so, here, so here's the DVD itself. Yeah, surprise, Nintendo hasn't re released a system that I can actually play DVDs. But yeah. And now for the game itself. And here's the warning and the game itself. Now I should mention that I did play Shattered Crystal, but I finished it in two days. 100% completed it in two days, returned it, and got Smash Brothers. So, yeah. Uh, hopefully this game is a bit long. I, it's better overall in length and gameplay. I know it is, but still. Yeah, well, yeah, that's the game. I'm really looking forward to it. As low as those expectations may be. And the fact that I got this right before the release of Sonic Forces. In fact, let me just say now, unless you're a really dedicated Sonic fan, I'd, I'd recommend Sonic Mania over this. Or heck, even... Or, or, the, or even the upcoming Sonic Forces, because, well... <laughs> they're paying yeah, I mean for one thing Sonic Mania is 20 bucks 25 and Sonic Forces is like another 15 15 to 20 dollars so you're getting a full console game as compared to a handheld game in 2017 looking forward to that when it comes out I even pre-ordered PS4 and Switch for it alright so that's all I got for today. Thanks for watching and take care.